and you guys were successful in back in a couple of weeks ago. What do you remember about that game that's going to be important for tonight? Yeah, we were just uh, playing with energy, changing up our defense a lot, um, playing with good pace, uh, made shots. So, you know, it was definitely a good game for us. But, oh, I mean, that's my fault. We got to uh, keep it up. You know, we're on a little, nice little streak right here. But we got to keep it up for tonight. You know, they're playing well, good team. So, we just got to keep the energy up. What are you looking forward to about another matchup between Kevin Durant, a guy that you're super close with and called like a brother? Yeah, it's good. Um, like I said before, like, these are the matches that, you know, coming into the league that you want to play like against. I was just, you know, lucky enough, fortunate to play with them for like two years or so. So it was definitely something I enjoy. But these are the matches that I look forward to, like playing against, like playing against guys like this. So, you know, I'll be ready again, chop on a good performance. So hopefully get the win, though. So that's all that matters. You praised him a lot for kind of taking you under his wing while he was here. What are kind of some of the things that you took from that experience, whether it was actual gameplay or just watching his work ethic or what have you what are some of the things you took from that time that you still use uh really all of it really just seeing how how he works um different tips he'll give me about in game you know when he was out he'll t give me some little nuggets so uh, you know, i cherish all that stuff i still use some of those now um but you know it's good good information it's good that you know he saw my potential and wanted to like help me when i was you know a young guy like a rookie and stuff, he just wanted to help me, just help me get used to the NBA game and get a feel for everything and how to be like more efficient scoring on the NBA level. So it was just good that he'll give me that information and, you know, I would say it's working right now for me, so it's good. I mean, you've always been a bucket, but I mean, are you yeah, a yeah. better player for having gone through that experience and having him here? Uh, probably just, not really just from him, probably just from my, you know, just me personally just watching just watching and just, you know, the experiences I've been through as far as like all this, all the, all the extra stuff, but definitely, you know, him helping definitely uh, is a part of that, so it was good. What kind of reception do you think KD will get tonight? I don't know. Um, you know it could be 50-50, you never know. But I think he should get a good one. You know, he did a lot, you know. He did a lot for the, um, for the team, for the organization, whether people want to say it or not, he did a lot for us. But, you know, I don't know. It'll probably 50-50. I don't know. I'm 50-50 on that. Hopefully it's good, though. I mean, it'll be good. I know it's two years, but is there a memory that just kind of stands out between you and him besides, obviously, the mentorship and development he gave you? No, nah, really just all that, like, all those moments that I cherished um, on the road, practice, um, just, you know, really off the court stuff. Really just all of it, just being able to have somebody that I can call him my brother, like, call him, text him whenever, you know, we talk. So. It's definitely good to have, you know, that kind of brotherhood with somebody like that. So I just cherish all the moments that I had when he was here. So and now we just got to, you know, compete now. So, I mean, I'll, that's that's even better for me because, you know, that's what I live for, competition against guys like that. So it was good. You already got to win against him. So is that motivating you to get two? Yeah, definitely want to sweep the season series. But, you know, definitely want to see the season series. But it's always just good to compete. But you know, I definitely want to get a win tonight, though. Definitely sweep the season series. Have a little bragging rights if we talk about it. So it'll be good. So you, was it an honor to be able to play with Kevin? Oh, definitely. It's an honor to play with everybody in the league. Um, everybody's here for a reason. Uh, I'd probably say that's all I got to say. Everybody's here for a reason. It's an honor to play with everybody in the league. So everybody's here for a reason. How, if at all, um, does uh, Ben being back change the dynamic of this team? Uh, it was good. He, uh, you know, 6'10", running the one, uh, puts the pace, you know, at a very high level, uh, gets on the board. So, you know, he changes our dynamic a lot, mainly so with our offense, like pushing the pace, getting out of transition, getting those quick, easy looks. That really helps us as a team because we get more possessions. We're not really playing late into the shot clock as much. But, you know, he changes the whole dynamic for sure. So it's good to have him back. With the addition of Ben, Jock mentioned about having to play different combinations and kind of different rotations. As a team, you know, you guys found success the other night, but what's just the approach of it for you guys going into this when there is still some newness as a group? For sure. Um, just um, not really uh, getting down when it gets tough, because obviously, you know, the last game, it was just everything was flowing for everybody. It's not going to be like that every game. We just got to stick to it and just know that, you know, Still some wrinkles because you know he's been out for a while, so we just gotta get used to everything, getting used, getting back used to how he plays, how he pushes the ball. So 
we just got to get back used to him in the lineup. But, you know, last game was just a little glimpse of what we could do when he is in the lineup and, you know, getting everybody in rhythm, getting everybody shot. So I feel like we played all around good game when he was back. So hopefully we keep it up tonight. Do you think this team is getting close to finding something coming off the back-to-back -back wins and the two losses that were close right before that? Yeah, I feel like we've always been like right there. Um, like Even when the games we lost, we had big leads. We just lost the lead at the end. I mean, we've been right there really all season, really. I don't think we really got blown out, but like a few times. So I feel like we've always been right there. Just you know, the extra stuff, like, you know, when we had the lead, keeping the lead, just a little, little extra stuff like that. But I feel like we've been right there all year. So we just got to, you know, get over the hump because you know, All-Star's about to come up, and that's when, you know, the games get more important, trying to get a playoff spot and stuff. So we just got to get more. You know, get more urgent in that aspect, but I think we've been close all year for sure. Yeah, trade deadline's coming up a little more than a week away. Is that something you guys talk about, or is that just an unspoken thing? Uh, I mean, it's unspoken, really. I don't really, nobody really want to talk about everybody's situation. I mean, everybody reads stuff, but I think it's unspoken. Nobody really talks about that kind of stuff. We just, we're just enjoying the moments that we have here and just playing together as a team. We play well as a team, but everybody gets along, so, you know, we're just enjoying the moment. Do you think about, you know, uh, additions that the team could possibly make? You know, what? No, I don't, I don't, I don't care, really. I mean, that's, that's not really my decision. No. These last six games, earlier in the season, it was a, a talking point. It was difficult for you and Mikhail to both be kind of cooking at the same time. These last six games, both of you guys, I think, are averaging about 25 points. What have you found that's allowed you guys to both get into your spots and get into your offense at the same time? Uh, just reps together. Um, and honestly, just seeing how the defense playing us, like, you know, just seeing how the defense plays us, but it's mainly just the reps together. You know, we've been on the court together a little bit more. Um, so that helps knowing, just, it's just knowing how each other play. Like, we know we know certain stuff and just just more comfortable. I was about to say there's the comfortable aspect. We're just out more comfortable together out there. So it's just, it's been good. Thank you, Yes, sir.